Hello and welcome back to my Final Fantasy XII Let's Play. Uh, we are, of course, picking up back where we left off. We've got uh, literally nobody in our party, but what you might notice is uh, over at the top right there, 239 uh, license points. So while I was watching uh, some videos, I decided to just uh, blindly farm diamond armlets. So we now have 18 of those to sell. And the main reason for that is just to give us a kind of a, um, a padding for money. Uh, I want to buy more gambits. Uh, I want to have all the gambits as, as, you know, as many or all of them as I can buy as we progress. And as you progress the story, more of them will unlock. So I just wanted to make sure we had a nice padding of, of cash. So with that being said, uh, let's go ahead and let's continue the story because, again, I want to get to at least a certain point in the story so that we can unlock the second job um, board, essentially. So, yeah, let's keep moving. Um, so we need to go see uh, Dallin and Pinello. So it doesn't actually tell us where to go. Um, I guess we'll go to... I guess we'll go ahead and just go. Oh, you know what? Googling attendant. Wait, where is he? Okay, so now we can kind of we can just jump around. So this is cool because we can go straight to the bazaar. Actually, speaking of that, we need to do that that hunt. We are we're probably way more powerful than we should be for that uh, Thexter hunt. Um, Southgate. I want to go to. We'll go to Southgate. Let's see if we can... We'll pop in and see if uh, our buddy is here. Where am I going? Okay, here we go. Dallin, if he's here. I, don't, I actually don't remember where we run into her. It might... Oh, you know what I think it is? Is the Sand Sea. Now that I say that, I'm pretty sure it's the sand sea. But I'll come in here anyways, just to see. Well, well. Look who we have here. Heard you were sent off to Nalpina. And I got out of there as fast as I could. But it was all worth it, down. Here, look at this. My, my, my. Quite a treasure you've got there. Well, you know, I couldn't have done it without your help. So, there is more to this gutter churl than first meets the eye. Van, I have an errand, a simple favor to beg of you. I was going to ask that kites to go, but I should think that you ought to do. No. No, I think you're just the one. There's a fellow by the name of Azalas, and I need you to bring this sword to him. That's... That's a sword of the old order. Speak my name when you arrive. That should be enough to get you in to see him. I've made a note on your map showing you where he can be found. Mind you, you are to deliver the sword to him personally. I will. And so it is done. But will it be enough to remind him of what the order once meant? Interesting. So that was part of what we had to do regardless. Okay, good to know. We have no one else in our in our group. Uh, we do need to hit the weapons and, you know, some of the other shops here just to be sure. Um, the initial version of this game used to be different shops had different, like, items and weapons. I think what they did was they updated it. So uh, as you progress in the story, which this was always the case, um, new things to become available, but I think what they did was they made it so all shops carried whatever, wherever you're at in the story, they're all at the same spot. I do believe, I could be wrong, but I believe that's how it is. Okay, let's do this part. I know this is this is part of the, the actual story, so. Hmm. 
Then what do you make of Andor's proclamation? Are you suggesting they fooled even the Marquis? What if a judge killed the king, not the captain? That would explain everything, wouldn't it? In that case, the captain would be brother to a judge. How are we to trust such a man? Huh? Now there is the Bosch that I remember. Then will you fight again at my side? His word alone convinces me of nothing. I'd take his word over that of a mouthpiece Marquis. Then you name Rex liar with him. My brother was no liar! <sighs> Just the opposite. Rex was the witness they needed. They had to make it appear as if I killed the king. Rex bears no blame. The fates have willed it. So this is Rex's brother. <sighs> Your words may convince a child such as this, but they weigh far too lightly on the scales for my taste. Our paths will remain separate. Do you not think Amalia worth saving? I hold men's lives in my hands. I must see foes in every shadow. The night we moved against Vane, he knew. I will not chance such disadvantage again. I must treat you as I would Ondor, as I would treat any of better of the Empire. Then what will you do? Hold me here in chains. Uh oh. <laughs> Some things never change, do they? Listen to me, Bosh. Your cage may have no bars, but it is a cage. The eyes of the Resistance watch unblinking. Let them watch. I know something of cages. That's right. Amalia's in the Resistance. Then you know her. Sorta. We met just before we got sent to Nalbina. I've known nicer people. Our paths keep crossing yours and mine. It's more than coincidence. It's annoying. I'm sorry. Allow me one last annoyance, a favor to ask. I want you to take me to both here. Even caged birds need wings. This makes us even. Even? For Nalbina. We couldn't have done it without you. Interesting. Okay. Oh, so now he's actually part of the party. That's pretty cool. And he also has his mithril blade. Which is actually better than the long swords we were stealing. That's pretty cool. Offhand. He doesn't have a... Uh... I mean, we can go ahead and give him that, but... Obviously, the bronze shield is slightly better. Um, he's got a lot of limit points, or license points, I should say. Let's go ahead and set him up. Okay, so here's the thing. Ninja is what I typically like him to be. And what is that? This is kind of weird. It's it's not blocking other characters. I wonder if you can actually have him be the exact same thing. I, they may, they may have changed that. I don't know, but um, Shikari, Shikari, where the hell is that? Okay, here we go. Oh, okay. So the daggers are on here. So yes, this is what I want him to do initially. The other thing he'll be doing is a foe breaker, which I think are axes. Um, okay, well, anyways. Shikari it is. Which essentially means that sword is going to be useless now. Which is ironic, considering I just... Um, I just unlocked that for him. That's funny. Okay, well, whatever. We gotta do this. Initially, he's going to be like a dagger master, but... So lots of game. I feel like they changed these boards again or something with with the since the last time I played it anyways. I'm going to at least give him this. Okay, this gives him the shields. Not that it really... Well, I mean, I guess it does kind of matter, actually. 
I think I went all the way to four. At least four for everybody. What is this? First aid. I mean, wouldn't be it the worst thing in the world. Okay, this is important. For sure. And that's where one of the ninja blades is, but we're going to hold on that. Um, with the ninja blades, again, unless they've changed it, you have to be really careful which ones you select. Uh, because you can cut yourself off from having all of them, basically. You can't have all of them, so you have to, you have to be pretty, pretty careful of it. So we're going to give him some health for sure. Definitely want this. Oh, all that is... We definitely want that one. We have to go into some accessories as well, because if we don't, we're going to be behind. far did I go on accessories? I went to six. You can see that this, you can just blast through the points real fast. We'll give him some physical attack bonuses here. Or battle lore, whatever they call it. But for 30 points, I mean, that's going to make him so ridiculously powerful get that eventually. Um, okay. Well. Ooh, that's really good there. Having this, so this is how remedies eventually become really awesome. There's three tiers of this, and once you get the one that removes stop, doom, and disease. Let's see if I can find the other two. One's up here. Petrify, compute, confuse, and oil. There's another one, too, but I don't remember exactly where it is. Oh, sh this one's... That would be good. Um, I really want swiftness. I gotta have... Just being able to swing faster is, is just too good. There's another ninja uh, sword. Okay. Oh, there's one. So sleep, sap, mobilize, and disable. So basically everything that's listed, once you have all three of those unlocked, um, whoever uses that that remedy uh, can basically can take off everything in one go. Where did I say? Okay, so this is going to be a big investment here. Probably should get more gambits, but I'm going to go ahead and take that too. Okay. Okay, we're good with that. That should that should make him pretty good for right now. Now he has 968 health. He's probably stronger than anybody we got right now. And we'll put the battle harness on him. That he's going to be strong. Okay. Okay, bam. I know that took a long time, but you do have to spend a little bit of time doing this. I forgot where we we're supposed to go. Okay, where would a thirsty power go? So that's what I was thinking when I said they were at the tavern. Uh, it turns out I, I had to talk to Dallin first. Let's see what this guy has to... No, and no. Amazing. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that so we can get some people back in our group. That's not where I want to be. It's incorrect. Also, I adjusted music again a little bit down. Um, and I moved my mic a little closer to me. Because I was noticing uh, through some of the playback, uh, 
It just seemed like the music in some scenes were really loud. So I do apologize if it's if it's difficult to hear me. Okay, now I wish there was just a buy all button. That would be amazing. I'm just gonna start buying everything. I, I just gambits are useless if you don't have a lot of options so that you can custom tailor what you want. So we are going to use our money, at least currently. Now that I have way more of those diamond, uh, whatever the heck's, like armlets. Those are pretty expensive. But eventually I'll come up with reasons why I would need one or the other. I should have looked at how much gill I had. It was, it was like close to 50,000. Maybe 47k or somewhere around there. I'll have to look back at the video. Of course, I'll forget to do that, but um, we'll just see uh, if this takes as much money as it, as it, I remember it taking. Because there are so many of these in here, but this this will fill up with so many um, spots in our uh, log. So we'll, we'll have so many options. We'll basically be able to handle anything. And when you go into specific fights and you maybe you don't do well in a boss or something, but you notice what they're doing, you can set up stuff to counter them. I don't foresee there being a lot of death on bosses unless we do the trials. But um, I mean, who knows? I could uh, I could end up being way worse at this game than I remember. So. Hopefully, that won't be the, the, the case. Yeah, these weak and uh, vulnerable ones are really good, too. There's going to be a place later in uh, the Hinna Mines that I'm going to farm the absolute... Well, I don't want to cuss, but a lot. Let me just put it that way. Um, and what you can... How long you can farm and what you can get out of that... It will make uh, farming the diamond armlets look pretty funny. Gotta have a mage to make it work. We're already down to 37,000 something. So it is starting to add up, for sure. If I hadn't farmed those armlets, I would have been more reluctant about this. But we've got a lot of money we can, we can gain back. Oh my god, we're not even halfway down the list. I'm sorry that I have to sit here and do this. The good news is, once we get this done, very rarely will they add more. Sorry that you have to sit here and listen to this. Let's just get it, let's just get it over with, though. One less thing we gotta worry about later. I believe this game came out in 2006, so consider how old it is relative to today's standards. The fact that it even still holds up is pretty, uh, pretty amazing. Okay, so we've, we've already spent about uh, roughly 20k. Clearly, it was not designed really with the intent that you could buy everything at once. Now, that being said, they did implement the change so that it didn't used to be that you could exit the trials and keep your stuff, but the devs specifically made that happen. So um, I, I think that's a huge and uh, very welcome change. Um, it makes the game even more enjoyable because, I mean, you know, I, I had mentioned uh, in, a, in a video or two prior to this that, oh yeah, you can just go in and steal what you want. I mean, it's still going to make you work for it. Uh, some of those steals are extremely rare steals you'd have to you you'd specifically want to have the uh, thieves cuffs on which make the rare steals a higher chance but they're still low compared to everything else right so you're still gonna pay in time uh, in you know rather than gill you'll be paying in time uh, to try to get these things 
Um, but dude, there is nothing quite like the feeling when you steal an ultra rare, like great sword or a um, you know an amazing uh, accessory item that you've been trying to get for who knows how long. Another way to get these items uh, used to be in uh, chests out in a specific area, uh, but the the chest had a low percent chance to spawn. And then on top of that, when they did spawn, they had a ridiculously low chance to have the item in it. Uh, I spent I spent way more time than I care to admit um, trying to get stuff out of those chests. So I would much rather know I'm going to you know have this opportunity in the trial um, than to do it that way. So, anyways, we just got all the stuff we needed there. Let's just pop into the technique store. Um, I forgot to look. I think it's going to be close to 30,000 is what it... Oh, well, okay. We'll do a cutscene first. A lot of kids lost their parents in the war. Mine... Mine had already died before that. The plague took them both. I'm sorry. I didn't know. It's okay. It's been five years now. After that, I lived with my friend Pinello and her family. Then... Then the war came. I am sorry. You don't have to keep apologizing. Really, it's all right. I know it wasn't your fault. I see that now. You didn't kill my brother. It was the Empire. My brother trusted you. And he was right. Well, it's about time, Vaughn. Get on board, buddy. Awesome. Oh, whoops. We're gonna pop in here and just see what kind of techniques they have. Because we're rich, we'll just go ahead and pick it up. Okay, or we won't. That's also that's also an option. Amazing. All right. Always looking for those little cartographer moogles. Got to get those maps. All right. Anyways, let's go in here and get get some people back. That'd be great. I assume that's what's going to happen. As I said, a misunderstanding. Misunderstanding? What I am understanding is it took Pinello because of you. What? What about Pinello? Oh, Vaughn. They've taken Pinello. And there was a note. A note for this Balfir. Come to the Museum of Mines, it said. It's Begamnon. He was in Nalbana. If anything were to happen to that sweet child, why, I have her parents' memory to consider. You're going to go to her aid, and that's that. That's what you Sky Pirates do, isn't it? I don't respond well to orders. You do know that the Imperial fleet is massing at Bujaba. Fine, then I'll go. You at least have an airship, don't you? <sighs> Just get me there, and I'll find Pinello myself. I'll join you. Huh? I have some business there as well. An audience with a Marquis, by chance? Both here. Just take us, and this is yours. The gods are toying with us. Uh, make yourselves ready. We leave soon. Right. Amazing. Okay, this is great. That's what we wanted. All right, now here's the downside. When I was doing all those bands, they did not get the points. Okay, I thought for sure they were going to get points, uh, the license points, which they did not, which means Vaughn now has 200 and something more than he really should, but that's okay, whatever. Uh, it's going to be fine. So, here's what we're going to do. First of all, we're going to look at our gambits because we forgot to look at all that. Okay, now look at all the different options we have. This is, that's so insanely better. All this that we can, we can use to basically do what we need to do. 
that feels that feels nice. Yeah, that, I don't think we're getting any more. That's pretty. I mean, with the exception of one or two, we can see we're missing. We're missing one, but that's just because of the people in the party. I think. So I think I think that's it. That yeah. Again, that was not intended to be able to just knock it out that fast. Okay, before we leave to go to this new area, one thing I definitely want to do is the hunt. So, um, we need to get that hunt done so we can get moving with that stuff. Okay, let's go down to the magic store. Let's make sure that we have everything that we need from the shops. And we will get that squared away. Okay, we've, okay, yeah, we've, we've purchased everything there, okay. I still forgot to look at how much money I had, but okay, that's fine. Okay, well, we're just going to pop down. I, at this point, I don't think anything new has shown up, but let's just look and see what they have. And if I have time, I'm going to try to knock that hunt out. Okay, so typically what they do is they put the best armor at the top, and then the the not as good armor it starts getting worse the, the lower down the list you go so that looks like that's what's happening here so headgear I mean what they have it doesn't none of this really matters so I guess we'll just um, I guess we'll roll with what we have oh man I forgot again to look at my money okay 24,000 so we basically we spent at least at least 20, 20,000 plus, I would say, maybe 22,000 just on the, the, um, gambits, or what are they called? No, I forgot now. I forgot to check the weapons. Oh, well, whatever. Um, so we need to go out this side. I kind of wish I could zoom that mini-map out a bit. That's why I keep pulling the map up, in case you're wondering. Um, yeah. I'm pretty sure he's on this side. This is also where I have to go for the mission. But we've never even exited to this side. We didn't see him anywhere on the right side, so let's just see if he's over here. I think he will be. This is an area we have not, just like, really done anything with. Um, okay, let's... Do we not have a map over here? I feel like we should have a map. Okay, so that's not him. Okay, that's definitely not it. We could get a chocobo if we really wanted it. That's going to make it a lot more annoying to find this guy, but okay, I guess. I will attempt it. We're kind of... Oh, okay, good. That, that reset the... Uh, that reset the storm. Okay, here he is, right here. Obviously, he's not going to stand a chance. We waited a bit long for that. Alright, we'll have to come back to this side. Um, I mean, eventually we're going to need this stuff unlocked. Normally, I would just do it, but... Let's just go ahead and try to turn this in. Where the heck is the... Yeah, we'll come fill this in later. Okay, now I need the teleporter, guys. Where are they at? Okay, here we go. So this helps us just get around. Um, we need to go to the Sand Sea. Now, one thing to note... Okay, so Clan Primer... Down here at the right, Hedgehog Knight. 
Uh, I don't even know what the point of the points are because normally I have in like th tens of thousands more points than is required um, to do what is uh, needed. Like there are point requirements and then there's like um, rank requirements for stuff. But because I tend to farm, I have never not had the points I'm supposed to have for stuff. Okay, so we got... That's great. All right. All right, see you later, buddy. All right, so now you can see we've got multiple ones. All right, so we're going to have to go out here to talk to that guy, so hopefully I'll remember that. This one's a little more challenging. And he's down in, this, in the ground. Okay. Alright, so we've done those. Now, let's go ahead and while we still have a minute... I mean, we're, we're kind of over, but... I want to do this so I don't forget. Now we'll, we'll use our little teleporter guy, and now we'll go to... Move through Bazaar. Two things we want to check there. So this puts us on the side of the map where we can go talk to um, one of our little friends, but we'll also talk here and see how... Okay, so we'll buy both of these, because why not? We're rich, right? I'll sell... Um... Where is it? I'll sell four of those and we're we're back where we need to be. And we still got money in reserve, basically. Okay, and then when we run up here, Mont Blanc is who I was trying to remember. Um, because he's gonna have like think of his hunts as like the super ultra versions of um the regular hunts. So the ones he gives you, you better be ready for that, because they're gonna they're gonna blow you out of the water. Okay, so he gives us some rewards for everything that we've killed. So now he's talking about the flans. He'll hook us up with that. That's what we get for that, because that was easy. I don't know what the hell that is, but cool. Queen, so the Mimic Queen. Okay. 300 gil. All right. Any new marks? Okay, so we've got two of them. So this one is hard. Unless, unless you're just overpowered, obviously. Okay, and so we have to talk to the lady out there. Okay. This is actually where we're headed, so we might as well pick it up now. Now, that might be hard enough to where it kills us. Who knows? What is this other thing it said? Oh, I want to change my license boards. Interesting. I had no idea that's where you do that. I haven't played since they put that in, so... I could do that to refund points and, and change what I buy, but really you're going down a, a set path regardless, so... Okay. Uh, let me go ahead and run down here. We'll save at the Aerodome. And... We will move forward from there in the next episode. So yeah, the little teleporting is actually quite good. It saves a decent amount of time, especially when we didn't have the, the run fast speed. Uh, is there a save over here? Yes. We got quite a bit done there. Also, you can see these were the two saves. It only showed about five minutes of me farming, but actually the majority of it wasn't being counted, as you can probably imagine. So we're going to just save over both of these. Okay. Alrighty. Well, we will return here in the next episode. I do hope you enjoyed, and we will see you next one. Have a good one.